Have you ever felt like there were walls like this that were so thick and so big? Things in your life that you can never conquer, you can never overcome them, you can never really destroy those walls and tear down those strongholds? Well, I want to tell you what. There was a great Christian in the Bible who felt that way. His name was the Apostle Paul. He wrote to the church at Rome in chapter 7 and he said, The things that I know I should do, I don't do those things. And the things that I know I shouldn't do, I end up doing those things. And he asked a question. He said, Oh, who shall deliver me from this bondage of sin? And then he answered his question. He said, I thank God through Jesus Christ. And you see, he knew the victory was not in himself. He knew he was a man like anyone else, and he struggled with all kinds of problems and difficulties and lust and anger and bitterness and all of those things that you and I struggle with. And he knew that he could not overcome them. But he knew that Christ had been tempted in the same way that we have been, but he was victorious. You see, the victory is not in us, it's in Christ. I have a friend who many years ago uh, would preach a message. His name was Mike Gilchrist. He's in heaven now. And he had a message that he would preach, and he would share this with, with people personally. And he really believed this, and I, I learned a great lesson from him. And this is what he would say, stop trying and start trusting. Stop trying to live the Christian life in your own power and start trusting Christ to live in you. That's the source of victory. And if you'll stop trying and trust Him, He will give you the victory in your life. And I want you to know something I, I, I learned. I, it was a hard lesson for me to learn, but I learned the truth of that message. Uh, you see, when I was a new Christian, I had a problem with jealousy. Some boy come talk to my girlfriend and I'd say, I'm not going to be jealous because I knew I was a Christian. I shouldn't be jealous. I shouldn't be angry. And I say, I'm not going to be jealous. I'm not going to be jealous. And oh, I would burn with jealousy. And I didn't know how to overcome it. And then I heard Mike's message, stop trying and start trusting. And I said, God, I cannot overcome jealousy, but Jesus has. And so I'm trusting him, not in myself, but in him to give me victory over jealousy. And do you know what happened? The next time I was tempted with jealousy, I trusted Jesus and Jesus gave me victory. And he'll give you victory. You see, don't try to do it in your own power. Stop trying and start trusting Jesus to live in you and to give you the power to be that person that you know God wants you to be, to do what he wants you to do, to obey his word. It's only by his power. So stop trying to do it in your own power and trust Christ to live in you and give you the power to be what he wants you to be.